Um, my name is Michael Adam Underwood. I'm 37 years old. Um, I work at UF in IT, and I am one of the D&D dads that helps run a uh, game here for the kids on the every Thursday, I think, or, or no, it's Tuesday, every Tuesday. A couple years now, I think we've been doing it, um, before the Coliseum of Comics became Coliseum of Comics when it was uh, Gamesville Tabletop, we were doing that. and. Um, I used to teach a lot of other people how to play other games. It's a thing I enjoy doing, and um, kids get excited about Dungeons and Dragons. Kids get excited about Dungeons and Dragons, uh, uh, so it's particularly fun to teach them to play. And then the games themselves encourage the kids to do group planning for things, to strategize together a little bit. I know that um, my middle daughter who uh, Mo has social anxiety and um, she opens up a lot when she's playing this game and I've seen other kids go through the same thing. My name is Imogen, I am 13 years old and I like Dungeons and Dragons. It definitely helps my social life, I kind of have anxiety so I don't really talk to people much but D&D gives me a chance to talk to people without having to like worry about like hey what am I talking about like it gives me a chance to like play as a character and like actually feel like I'm saying something that makes sense. My name is Delia, I'm 14 years old, and I've been playing D&D for about almost two years now, about a year and a half. Um, I think it's really helped a lot, and I had problems, like I was an extremely shy person, I hated being around other people, but it's honestly helped a lot with like speaking to other people, and like getting to know people, and just like making new friends. My name is Ellie Morales, I'm 15 years old, and I've been playing D&D for a year and a half. Um, it helps my creativity and I get to meet new people because I'm not very good at meeting new people. Ellie is on the autism spectrum and we were looking for something where she could participate with a small group and make friends but without being overwhelmed by too many people. And I had heard that D&D was kind of good for that, so I asked on my Facebook, does anybody know where there's kids D&D? And somebody recommended this place. And we've been coming for over a year, and she loves it.